G'day fellow YouTubers and fans of the AU Falcon. This is Jimmy Hack here doing an upgrade on this AU. Um, if you've been watching the channel you know that we made nearly 200 kilowatts. Uh, that's a theoretical 200 kilowatt at the engine. Unfortunately it started to lean off in the top end and also I think it's running out a bit of airflow as well. These heads and manifold are only so good. But I'm going to put these BA injectors in it. That's the part number. Let's see if you can see that. INJ032M by this crew here. Um, things to be aware of when you're working on a red top motor, the regulators in them come with a 3.5 bar regulator. The standard silver top is only 2.7. So there's a difference there on those two. Um, I'm going to run with the three and a half bar reg, this one, and uh, run through these injectors. But I've been told that it could run rich at idle with the BA, so this is what I've got to counteract that. All right, so here's uh, another manifold I preferred. Prepared earlier. <laughs> preferred. Bloody prepared. So yeah, we've got, um, we've tapped some uh, threads in here. This is to bleed off. I've got um, this valve here, it's part of the EVAC system. You can hook up a micro switch to the um, throttle. And on idle, I can basically bleed off uh, so that it's running a bit leaner instead of being rich. Makes it very doughy taking off if you've got a rich condition. So they, they do work better slightly lean. So yeah, I've got to put this in, work out what size I need. I've got a whole heap of different variations of those. Whether I need one, two, or some larger ones, it doesn't matter. I've got plenty to um, work with, so that's going to be trial and error. So at the moment, the engine's theoretically making about 200 kilowatts. It's making about 158 at the treads, I think. So on dyno day next week, we may be able to crack the 165, 170 at the treads. Who knows? We'll see. See what this um, stock motor's capable of. It's a stock basically stock head, stock manifold as you can see, it's only got a cam in it headers, cold, in, cold air intake, so yeah she's pretty well stock um, the limiting factor I think on this motor is going to be the head flow so we may not be able to get over 200 kilowatts based on the head but we'll see what it's capable of doing in a standard type format and then we'll do some work on the head and see if we can crack about 225 kilowatts out of it, that's 300 horsepower um, they're certainly capable of doing that I know guys in the speedway industry that do it, so we'll see um, see how it goes. It's just something to be aware of when you're putting BA injectors in, guys. You've got to um, got to accommodate the rich condition at idle, and just be aware that there's a couple of different regulators. I'll give you the part number actually. So the three and a half bar. That's the Bosch part number. 02801605592. And then there's a 2.7, which the silver motor comes with as, as factory. All right, so I hope that helps out, guys. Till dyno day next week. We'll throw it up there and we'll see what this, this can do. Okay, till next time.